Hey everyone, what's up? It's Ventus with Fire Emblem Heroes. For this video, I'm going to be doing the Yusuke Kozaki trial maps. I don't know why his name is listed as Kozaki Yusuke in English, even though this is his last name. Uh, but I'll be doing these maps on hard mode. I already did the, the normal ones. They're level 40s. I'm assuming that these are going to be skill inherited because uh, these battles weren't. Uh, as for the team I'm going to use, I'm not going to use my arena team for this week. I'm going to use... A specialized team, I guess, for taking out these colors. And I'm also going to try and adhere to the rules of the quest. This one, I think, is clear with a red unit. Oh, wait, no. That's the next one. This one is clear without losing a single unit. So I'm going to build a team around the enemy. I can't remember what it was. I think it's like... Is it the Lucina map? Okay. Well, regardless of what this map is, let's have some fun with it. We'll use Alphonse, Sharina... Anna, and I'll add in Takumi for colorless. Here I go. Let's do it. Oh, it's this one. Oh, oh crap. Okay. I see. Okay, uh, am I screwed then? <laughs> I don't know how to deal with this team with my units. Holy crap. Wait, they're not skill inherited. They just have really crazy stats. What the hell? What are these stats? Oh my god! 60, 62 attack Effie! Uh... Uh... Okay, may maybe I need to switch up my team. I think this Takumi wrecks me, because mine has 25 speed. 37 speed Takumi. I can't outspeed yes. Takumi on anyone. Even Anna can't outspeed, and Anna's super fast. Yes. Holy crap. Okay, well, I think I have to restart. I'm pretty sure I need to restart, because the enemy team is so scary. Okay, well, Alphonse is dead. <laughs> I guess I failed the quest. Uh, Alright, alright, alright. Gonna use some of my favorite characters from their respective games. And we're gonna tip the scales, I guess. I think if you've watched my other videos, you should know how much I love Xander and Cherche. Although Cherche I don't talk about as much as Xander. If you watch my Fates playthrough, definitely. You know how much I love Xander. You! I will destroy you with Xander, I think. We'll do it this way. If he walks up 1-2 and attacks this tile after the dance, uh, oops, what am I doing? Should be like this. She actually has a defense aura. Defense buff. Oh wait, no, she doesn't. Oh, what the hell? Is she not... She has the SP. Oh, crap. Okay, well, she can learn it. It's just unfortunate she hasn't learned it yet. Okay, well, that was the plan, but I guess this will have to do. He's not going to die, is he? Nah. Okay. Okay. Shall we? I'll push Shershay in the back. Tip the scales. Oh my god, Robin is so horrible. Robin's stats are just really bad. T4 Robin. This is a neutral Robin. Let's go. T4 Robin's pretty awful. Oh crap. I need to let him attack me so I vantage him. Okay. Jeez, that's scary. Elise almost kills me? Wow. Damn, Robin. You know, Robin in his game obviously was really broken, and, and they can't make him that broken in this game. It'd be unreasonable if he did. But at least give him, you know, some kind of power, right? Let's go. Give him, like, a rally instead of a spur. Because Robin was known for his rally spectrum. I don't know what's up with Defiant Speed, though. I don't think he had anything like that in his game, did he? I can't remember even if he did. Oh, ouch. 
At least she's gonna be an issue, because this is a T3 Cherche with 42 attack against 40 defense. So I'm not even sure if she can if she can do any damage. Shall we? <laughs> oh my god. Okay then, Robin. Uh, you're up, I guess. Minerva. Minerva can just sit back there. I mean, uh, Cherche. Minerva too. Minerva the dragon. Hmm. I think I'll just use my favorite characters from each game to do it. Lead on. Holy crap, this is brutal. Will she reach me? She goes one and then she moves one up. She can only move one up, so she won't actually reach up. Unless she goes this way. But I think she'll go down because, uh... All right. Yeah, don't do that. Let's go. Okay. She could move right, actually. If she does move right, then I'll be in trouble. Because then she gets to dance and kills Olivia. And I can't reposition because I don't have it on her yet. Hmm. Okay. I could just bait her into Birthright AI. That works. Do I double her? No, I don't because she has Wary Fighter. And she outspeeds Shall me. We? Shall we take 24 or 30 damage and deal 10? I guess we will. Wait, was it not 30 damage? Huh? Oh, Xander Spur, right. Xander Spur defense. Cool. Lead on. Now what? This actually will kill. Okay, good, good, good. I can actually kill now. Good job, Robin. You did it. S sure. Let's go. There are actually a lot of characters in this game that uh, aren't as good as they were. I'm trying to think which characters. I think Cherche is pretty much the same. Robin is obviously a lot weaker. Xander is... Let's go. A bit weaker, I guess? Wait, she actually kills you? No way. Xander dies to Olivia? It's because Xander can only counterattack with two range. Wow, you actually die. Okay then. Uh, we'll kill you. Maybe we'll do an Olivia fight, but I get doubled and she has like 20 more attack than me. So I guess Robin's gonna carry this. Saizo is one of them. Saizo is one of the characters that are. Uh, one of the characters that's like really broken in this game. But. Alright. Jeez. But, uh, he's really bad in this game. Lead on. Like, horrendously bad. Okay. Wow, Robin actually carried. Interesting. Okay. Oh, actually. Oh crap. Oops. Wait, am I alive? I mean, I mean, should I be alive? Hmm. I guess I'll just Luna her. Olivia kills Olivia. Wow, that was a struggle. <laughs> that was actually a struggle. Damn, these guys are really powerful. They're not skill inherited like I thought they would be, but they're uh, a lot stronger than I thought. Damn, Lloyd is so ugly. Okay, I'll use this team. Lucina, Erica, Xander, and George. I wouldn't say George is one of my favorite characters from Shadow Dragon, but he was a solid unit for sure. Oh, Much spring. better than Gordon. Oh, it's the Roy one. Yeah, it's Marth Lynn Roy. A fine day. Obviously, Xander is one of my favorites. Because it's the same unit as the previous one, just more fabulous. This Xander is so fabulous. <laughs> I wonder if everyone at my castle found the eggs I hid. Jeez, Xander, please. What's next? I like Erica more than Ephraim. Erica's is awesome. 
I'm not a big fan of Ephraim. Yes. People like him though. All right. Nice weather. Nice weather. Of course. Oh, spring. Let's go. This map should be really easy. Oh, they're avoiding Lucina because they don't want to get chunked. They're like, huh, Xander's not as bad as Lucina, and then you realize yes. he quadruples you. Goodbye. Yes. I really gotta pull some better fodder. I need a fairy fodder so badly for her. And I need a... Uh, I guess I could just upgrade one of my Odins to T4 and give her Moonbow. Okay. But yeah, much is needed. Right. That's what happens when you're free to play. So I don't understand the maps. The uh, the art, the art the character designer, not art designer. The character designer didn't work on these characters, right? Because these are from older games, obviously. And he didn't do the art for the ones in this game, also. Did he draw Lucina? No, no, no. He actually didn't do too much of the art in this game, I think. His his design is actually really... Like, if you've seen his if you've seen his design, you probably know it's him. Like, the, the character on the screen is a character from uh, Fire Emblem 13. He's also in Awakening. One of the DLC characters. Very uh, notable style. Of course. This artist. Holy crap, that's a strong race. Holy crap, that's a strong race. Is Xander gonna die? Oh my god. What if Xander dies? Ready. Crap, I need to take a hit from oh, Lynn to redirect her. Okay. Yes. Damn, that Lynn is so fat. Is this like a, a plus all stats team? Is that what it is? Because I think plus attack Lin is 44, plus speed Lin, I don't know if she's 45. I think she's supposed to be 40? So these guys have super inflated stats. Let's go. Oh, yeah, oh, it's Roy. He's not gonna do damage. Reese might kill though. Oh my god, that heal! Holy crap, Reese is busted. Nice weather. And I can't kill him. I can kill Roy though, because Roy is garbage. Right. Wait, no, I can't. Oh crap. Oh, spring. Okay, I can kill you. I think I need backup. Lucina, help me. Ready. Yes. I think Erica gets attacked. As long as I don't. Hmm. As long as I don't attack Roy, he won't prioritize healing. Nice What's next? But I want to lower his, uh, his attack. Does it matter? No, it doesn't. I'm just gonna turn. Oh, Roy attacked first, so he's gonna heal then. Oh no, he's not. Wow, this is a greedy healer. This is the guy you don't want in MMOs. The healer, the healer that goes for four damage instead of healing your actual damage dead. dealers, and then you leave them to die to fabulous Xander. Horrible, horrible. Yes. It's not like he's lit. It's not like he lives anyway, right? He also dies. Or does he? Yes. Damn, this guy is so tanky. What the hell is this? Look at those stats. Twenty-six defense is actually really good. Obviously, forty-one resist and uh, forty-six HP is insane. Of course. Let's go. Oh, spring. Oh, he does die, because he counterattacks and then I move above him, right? Nice. Destroyed Reese. It might be more interesting if I do this without skill inheritance, but whatever. It's just a it's just a fun playthrough. Playthrough where I just talk about random stuff. Like the artist. For some reason, his last name is listed first. Is it actually like that though? Some artists stylize their names. So maybe he's more known with this name compared to his, his real name or his like actual, if we were to say it in English name, it would be Yusuke Kozaki. 
Actually, I don't know the characters for this, so I might be pronouncing that wrong. Could be Kozaki. Could be Kozaki. I don't know what it is. Damn, my uh, favorite character units is actually running really low. For this map, anyway. So let's see how this works. Spring is here. I have the other Camilla, but uh, she's not leveled up, unfortunately. Ah, oh, crap. Right. Oh, damn it. Oh, I have a blue tome. We have a blue tome here, so that's good. Robin versus Robin. Okay, this Camilla is going to be an issue, I think, because I don't have any sword users. Oh, crap. Hmm. Okay. Damn, Obro is so bad in this game. Obro was not bad in Fates. That's another character that's different. She was actually a strong unit in, in Fates. She pales in comparison to Hinoka, though. I think Hinoka as a Spearmaster is better than Obro. Generally. Spring is sprung. But Obro's very good. Let's go. She's one of the few tanky units you get that should be tanky. The other tanky units you get that shouldn't be tanky are uh, Hinata and Tsubaki. It's really weird. Oh, cra okay, okay. I need to change my team for sure. I can't, I can't do it. I can't, I can't kill this Camilla. Spring is sprung. It's impossible. I think I actually just die here. Beautiful. Yeah. These two are just too weak. This is a minus attack Camilla. This is obviously a neutral Robin, but Robin's not very powerful. Okay, let's bring back Center. There's really not much I can do. I'm just, I just don't have the units to do it. My I'm trying my best. I'm doing my best. Well, my best Nino impression, right. but it's not working. It's because I don't have units like Ike. Ike would be considered one of my favorite characters. Uh, what other sword users are there? Or like mages? Red mages? Celica is... You know, playing, after playing Echoes, I think Celica is one of my favorite characters. But obviously I don't have her. She's new and she's one of the focus heroes and I have no orbs! Uh, what else? I guess Alm too. What other what other red users are there that I like? Oh, there's Long Ku, but he's a piece of garbage in this game. Long Ku's awesome. All right, let's just sit here then. Hinoka's gonna be the, the big problem. There we go. Uh, Robin. Robin versus Robin. On it. Wow. Spring is sprung. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what to say about this. Let's just kite back. I think kiting back is the safest option I have. Oh man, it's kind of a waste of bonfire, but whatever. Let's At least go. I live. Beautiful. I guess a rally attack on her would have worked too. But then, I don't know if she can tank up. Kinoka very well. I guess she could, actually. No, no, she actually could. It's the quadruple I'm kind of scared of, but yeah, it's fine. It would have been fine. Oops. Okay, so if I eliminate her this turn... Right. Oh, God. Spring is sprung. My turn. I think I need to deal the finishing blow with Sharina. 19 HP remaining. Hmm. Well, 15, on it. 8. Yeah, I'll do okay. that then. Because I don't want Shamina to take too much damage, because she has Fury anyway. Fury is a lot of damage. Let's go. Robin... Robin actually hits pretty hard, this Robin. 44 attack, minus 25 resist, 19 damage, no double. 33 plus... It's actually 38. No, 37. So yeah, it's fine, though. Okay. I'm really enjoying Echoes right now. Oh, wait! Oh my god, you double her, right! Yes. Alright, that's a lot better. Actually, would he double minus speed Nino? Yes. He would double minus speed Nino. But his damage is low. 
It's, uh... He was here, wasn't he? Would have been 44 minus 8, which is 36. 36 minus 27 is 9 damage times 2, 18 damage. So yeah, the Sharina attack was the best for her, or for him. Robin versus Robin, who will win? Apparently both of them are pretty damn weak. My turn. Okay. Oh yeah, there we go. I actually like Nino. Let's go. But I don't like using her because you get her way too late. Even though her growth rates are good, growth rates don't mean everything in a game. A lot of people don't realize that. Can I one shot Sita? You know, I wonder why Sita doesn't have a, a spear. Because isn't she supposed to use the wing spear? That's her weapon? She comes as a T4 T5. So T4 could be like silver spear, and a T5 would be wing spear. Right? That makes sense. Let's go. But unfortunately, they added more sword users because we definitely need more sword users. It wasn't like the last four grand hero battles or something. We're all sword users or something like that, right? Uh, the lords in every game are sword users. We need more sword users. Okay. Well, Julia is not one of my favorite characters because I've never played Fire Emblem 4, but I like Julia. I like her voice actor. <laughs> She's one of my favorite Mother, voice actors. You always watch over me. May you never be hurt. What a calm, relaxing voice. All right. We're back to Lucina. Sharina's still there. I, I really like Sharina, actually, in this game. I don't like her voice actor, but... You know, like personality wise, it's personality in this game. Ha ha ha. Stupid crossover game. The garbage story. But yeah, she seems like a, a cool character. She seems like a cool person to hang out with. Because she's like the princess, but she's not very princess like. But yeah, ha 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 story in Fire Emblem. Good one. The Order of Heroes is simply spectacular since. I'm not a fan of her voice actor. That's the only thing. Okay, what is this map? There's only two blue dra- oh, there's three blue dragons actually. Wait, why is- oh, I guess Noe makes sense. Because Noe's from Awakening. There's Lucina? Not even the artist. Wait, isn't this what- Laura Bailey? Why is the voice actor not listed? Oh, I can't even listen to her. Kira Bucklin, also known as 2B. Alright, Leo. Die. I know Leo's a really popular character, okay. especially in Japan. Let's go. Cause they like that cool, calm male character. Oh what the hell? I've never heard Katri's voice. I must never bring shame to the White Wings. Allies help one another. <laughs> that laugh though, it sounds it sounds like a Nivea from League. I I have a lot of respect for you. Do you really? Whatever you need, I'll get the job done. See, this is why this is a fan service game. Because every character treats you like you're some kind of god. I hate that so much. But yeah, Leo's a really popular character in Japan. I don't know if he's as popular here in the West. In his game, he's a piece of garbage, though. I loved it when people tried to argue that Leo was good. It's like, oh, Leo's a very tanky mage, and, uh... He does a lot of damage, he has an exclusive tome, he's a good unit. And then you realize that Brynhildr in Fates, a tome, is a red weapon. His other weapon type, swords, are red. And the map you get him on is all flyers, all Pegasus and Kinshi Knights. So magic damage dealer with below average attack, two red weapon specialties. You're going to do really well on that map. Especially considering you get Keaton on the same map, who kills flyers and, and beasts because of his weapon. Yeah, I'm definitely going to use Leo over Keaton. 100%. Oh, spring. Of course this is on Lunatic. If you play like normal or hard, I don't think it's going to matter as much. Leo's a pretty mediocre unit. Dark Knights were okay in Awakening, but they got like super nerfed in Fates. 
Just like mages in general. Can I tank her? 39 speed. Understood. I get doubled. And I have Lance Breaker instead of Sword Breaker. Let's go. Let's just play it safe then. The hell was that pivot? Will I survive against Lucina? I'm actually curious. She doesn't get super buffed if I kill Erica this turn. Easy now. Okay, that's actually hard. How pleasant. Oh crap, this is actually hard. I I know that what? you die. For sure. Damn it. This is actually kinda of difficult. You got it. She's got good armor. I mean, uh, defense. Armor? She's not a Nivea. Actually, is she a Nivea? I want to check this out. Oh, she voices Setsuna and Felicia. Oh, wow, she voices Felicia. Felicia's one of my favorite characters in Fates. I mean, she's not that good of a, a unit, but I love her personality. She also voices Operator 210 in, in Nier. Nice. 210 is awesome, too. I can hear that, actually. I can hear the voice. Yeah, I can hear it. I recently finished Root B in Nier. Uh, Anivia is not voiced by her, unfortunately. So we have Operator 210. Of course. Operator 60. And 2B. We just need Alm now for 9S, and we have the Nier, Nier Automata team. Damn, I should do that. Should I? I should probably try and do that in the future. Erica, Cat. Oh, that's a really bad team. <laughs> that's an awful team. Erica, Setsuna. No, that that's really bad too. Damn, it's not very good, is it? Because Alma's Alma's red, Erica's red. They both kind of, I mean, Alma's damage and Erica's more support, but they're both like not really powerhouse reds. Because even as a as a damage unit, Alma isn't that strong compared to let's say like Lucina or. Ike, or Ryoma, right? Even Krom. Krom is really powerful. This is so scary. I need to tank one of them. I think, uh... Understood. I think, uh... Yes. Oh, spring. I rally speed. I still can't double. These guys are so... F what? Yeah, I don't know. These units are so overstated. My turn. Okay. Well, we'll do it this way, I guess. All right. Oh crap! Julia's dead. Oops. No, why would you kill your operator? Why would you do that? 2B. Infected with a logic virus. Killing operator 60. Bad ending. Alright, let's do it this way. I think Erica is the best one to tank. Revenge. How dare you kill 6-0. Oh, that was actually really scary. Getting repositioned into range. Oh, I don't have skills on her right now. Because she's fresh from Arena. Otherwise, I could just reposition. Easy now. Wait, what? You don't kill? Oh, wow. Damn, 2B is so OP. Okay. I mean, that's true. It's definitely true. So I think I need to switch up with Sharina. Jeez. If I don't kill 2B this turn, then I'm going to be in trouble. All right. I guess I can kill 2B using... 6-0. 2-1-0 works too, but I think 2-1-0 takes too much damage. I could just kite back. Hopefully I'll be fine. I think she's gonna rally bot. Actually, who voices Noe anyway? Gotta find out. I don't know who that is. In terms of uh, other voices. Well, she voices a lot of characters that I don't know. Or that I'm less familiar with. I know some of them. Nothing, nothing big, I guess. 
I think Noe is probably one of her bigger roles. Okay, this is over. So let's use 210 to take revenge on 2B. Actually, we'll do it from this tile, because I need... That doesn't matter, actually. Easy now. Die, 2B. Oh, Lucina, Lucina. This is like the this is the same thing that happens in Arena when I use Lucina. Lucina kills Lucina. Rip. I gotta pull the red Lucina one day. Like seriously, I really want her. And then Six can take out Noe, also known as Noe. Oh yeah, the operators win. All right, let's try this out. Niles is level thirty-four, but I think it might be okay. We'll see. Do my best. Naz is one of my favorite characters in, in Fates. Cause he's so awesome. He's so fun. So funny. But he's really bad in this game. Let's go. He's so bad in this game. Holy crap. I guess technically if you took Niles as an archer and put him into this game, he would actually be like this because he gets garbage attack and really good speed and resistance and garbage defense. It makes sense. Like his stats make sense. But in his actual game, you can make him a bow knight, and uh, he gets good mobility. Mobility is not really a factor in this game. Imagine if there were bow knights. If he had five effective range, bow knight with like forty speed, thirty-five attack, thirty-five resist. That'd be pretty good, actually. Uh, what else? Oh yeah, and he doesn't get shuriken breaker. Not that ninjas are an issue in this game, but shuriken breaker is extremely useful in Fates. If you play, especially on Lunatic, especially on Realma's map. Damn it! I want Klein. Oh crap! How do I deal with this team? Cause oh god, you can't kill yes. Klein. Oh. And now, now, be gentle. Yours until I break, Master. Oh my god! That line. Yeah, how do I kill Klein? He has low defense, but he quick reposts me and I die. Ready. I'm using 2B this time. Ready. Really? This is not Ready. gonna go well. I th I think I need to switch up the team. Using my favorite characters just doesn't really work that well. Cause a lot of the units that are really powerful in this game are not my favorite characters. I might just switch back to Xander actually. Switch out Olivia for Xander. But I need to call this unit on this map, so I'm probably going to use Takumi. I like Takumi as as a, a unit, not so much as character. Okay, I pr I'm pretty sure I need to restart this. This is not going to work. The enemy team is just too powerful. These are all really powerful units. Death Blow, high attack, really high attack, really high attack, really high attack. Okay, well, I had to use a stamina potion, but uh, I think we're fine this time. Does he die to Glacies? He might die to Glacies. I gotta be really careful then. Hey, they're actually a pair. Kinda. They could be a pair. That's the thing with Fates, the, the pairings are just whatever you want them to be. 45, 51, 51 minus 43. How much is that? 51 minus 43 is 8. 8, 8, 8. 32 damage, and then Glacies is 28 divided by... what is it? Not divided by. 80% of 28 is uh, like 24? 25? So Xander actually does die. Okay. Oh wait, no, he doesn't get quadrupled. Because of 2B. Oh nice! Holy crap, 2B, you're awesome! On it. Ready! Who voices Obero anyway? Do my best. I don't know who that is. Let's find out. She voices Effie. Oh wow. That I didn't expect. I guess Obero is the Effie of Birthright. High defense. Although not as high attack, because I don't think most people have as much attack as Effie. Nobody has as much attack as Effie. She's got a pretty nice voice, though. I don't have a dancer reposition, so if I poke her down, then I actually end up dying. I might have to tank her with Xander. Or kill her with Xander, and then kill Sanaki with Takumi. 
I guess Obero could poke Sanaki as well, but I don't know if uh, they'll be in range properly. Xander definitely... Oh, actually, Xander can tank Sanaki. Maybe I'll do that then. 53 minus 21 is 40, 31, 30, 32. No Spur. If I had a Spur, she would die. I want I want Xander to just kill everyone. I think he can. If I use Bonfire on Sanoki, she dies. But there's a good chance that I use Bonfire on Julia instead. You know what? I'm just gonna kite back. Ready. Okay. Let's go. I think it's fine okay. if I kite back. Damn, there's no world where Sanaki attacks first. That's the problem. Hmm. Oh, there is now. Hold on. One, two, three, four. Oh, crap. I should have moved that way. Damn it. Oh, crap. I messed up. I should have moved there. I don't have a reposition. Let's go. I have to make Sanaki attack first. Otherwise, I can't kill. Yes. Can I still make Sanaki attack first? I think I can. What the hell? She moved that way. That's not fair. Damn it. Ah, oh, that's upsetting. That's very upsetting. Ready. Okay, Let's go. I'm gonna continue to manipulate this and, and maneuver around. It's gonna work soon. Maybe. No, it's not. I think it's over. Oh my god. It's okay, I used the stamina pot. Okay, this timeline is going to work, I'm pretty sure. Let's go. If it doesn't work, then rip, I guess. This better work. <laughs> like, seriously. Sonic attacks? No! Why? Hector! No! Okay, I used Mila's turn wheel. And now I have a successful timeline where Sanaki dies to bonfire. Hmm. Nobody else is in range. Finally! I did it. Mila's turn wheel is OP. Yes. Let's go. Ready. There we go. Finally. And now I think they all die to Xander. Xander Emblem. Pretty sure they all die. Okay. She has 17 defense. Let's 50, 50 equals 60. 60 minus 17 is 1 plus lethal. Klein will die for sure, yeah. Okay. Come at me. Do my best. Oh, crap. I just realized. Somebody here is going to get attacked. It's going to be 2B. Ready. Crap. That's not good. On it. So, Julia doesn't actually die this turn. Ready. It's okay. 2B can kill 6-0 pretty easily. Let's go. Die. Okay. Oh god, don't do that. Hmm. Oh, actually, I don't know if that was a good idea, because I can't attack Hector from uh, with another unit, or buff with another unit at this point. Okay. Yeah, Fury actually ends up killing me. Unless okay. this kills. 2 HP remaining? This probably yes. kills. Yeah, this is fine then. We'll do it this way. 2B's OP. Who voices Hector anyway? Oh! Patrick Sates. Who does he voice again? This guy has a lot of roles. He voices Camus in Fire Emblem Echoes. 
He voices Draug and Hector and Heroes, two big armored units. Yeah, he's kind of got that big burly voice. Fits the character quite well. Juris in Atelier Aisha. That's a role I know. Oh, he voices Basilio! Basilio was a badass. And he voices Zeta in Disgaea 4. Fenric too, but Fenric's like whatever. He's alright, I guess. Artanis in StarCraft? Really? Isn't Artanis more of like a calm demeanor kind of person? I guess when he was younger, he was kind of rash. Kind of like Hector. But Artanis in StarCraft 2 definitely isn't like that, I think. He voices Kog'Maw, Lucian, and Renekton. Oh, wow. Did not know that. I didn't know Lucian and Renekton shared the same voice actor. You really can't tell, and obviously, obviously Kog'Maw's like, monster voice. Yeah, this guy's been everywhere. He voices Garrosh and Arthas in Warcraft. Those are pretty big roles. I'm just scrolling back. Dracula in Castlevania Dracula X Chronicles. Oh, he voiced Dracula in Symphony of the Night? Really? In the 97 version? Isn't that the Dracula that's well known for being terribly voiced? Or is it in the remake? Or maybe he voiced both and uh... Holy crap, he voiced Dracula a lot actually. Order of Ecclesia as well. Yeah, he, he's actually Dracula's main voice actor. That's pretty cool. I knew he was popular and uh, he gets around everywhere. Didn't know he was that popular. Let's go. But now he dies. Okay, so everything's completed. All the quests are completed. And uh, yeah, we got all the orbs as well for the Yusuke Kozaki trial maps. Kozaki Yusuke? Whatever he wants to be called. If this is what he wants to be called, that's fine. Alright, so that'll be it. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. I'll probably do a summon tomorrow. That'll be the last summon I do for a very long time. Because I want to start saving for other heroes. I want to do the summon with the, the Klein Ninian focus. Yeah. Alright. This video ended up being like, talking about voice actors and like random stuff. That was hardly Fire Emblem at all. But yeah, that'll be it. So, I'll see you next time. Check out Arena, Summons. Check out Kozaki Yusuke's work. He's a pretty cool artist. And check out the Fire Emblem Echoes playthrough, which I'll be putting up daily. Uh, I'm on Act... Almost on Act 3, I think. But the episodes on YouTube are going to go a lot slower, obviously. Yeah, check those out. Da, 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 da. See you guys next time. Have a nice day.